TMF Pro 10K has been a product that's been on the market for about five years. And we've continued to tweak it and make it better and better all the time. Recently what we did is we went ahead, since we invented a polyester hydrotope to use in powders, we're the first to do that by the way, we went ahead and added it to our Pro 10K. So basically what is Pro 10K? Pro 10K is a bio-based product. Bio-based products are used in enzyme products throughout the whole industry and a lot of people like them. Generally it's take a little more time and you a little more agitation, but you really get some good results with it. Well just consider Pro 10K a bio-based enzyme product on steroids, especially with the poly product added to it. Now, uh, it basically has a lot of the components from our secret and uh, free and clear product, our spike product, and it has Grout Master and our Puro 2 built right in there. But uh, it basically has everything under the kitchen sink along with the enzymes and the polyester. So for carpet cleaners who are really maybe working into areas like maybe Section 8's or really dirty, nasty carpet jobs all the time, this is probably a really good product for you because it'll cut right through them like butter. It's basically a nuket type product that really um, works on speed and efficiency and it helps you cut through in situations where you might not be able to prevac, where there's no electricity and nothing like that. So you need something that's really strong to cut through all of that and that's what this is right here. And uh, when it comes to a rinse, I might recommend using an acid rinse. Our acid rinse basically has uh, a powerful surfactant along with it, so it gives you that one-two punch, and it lowers the pH. However, in those Section 8 type situations, more likely you're better off to use an alkaline type pre-spray uh, rinse, so that way you get that one-two combo punch to really knock through it and really take care of all those really, really dirty situations. Now remember, all, just about everything is on the label here. Let's talk about the mixing directions. You really don't need as much as some of the other products, maybe three, to, I mean two to three ounces, remember these are two ounce scoops, two to three ounces in a electric sprayer or a pump up sprayer and for light soils and maybe just a little bit more, maybe four, three to four ounces if you have heavy soil. Okay now when it comes to an inline sprayer you're going to be using, remember inline sprayers come with either a yellow tip which is usually stock and standard which is nine, eight to one. You pop that out and now it's four to one. Okay, and we have dilution ratios for both. I personally prefer a four to one dilution ratio. So if you're using it as a four to one dilution ratio, you're only going to need two to five scoops. If you're using it as an eight to one dilution ratio and you're leaving this in there, you're going to be using four to nine scoops. So why the differences between the amounts of each one of them? That's because you don't need as much if you're working with nylon carpets or if you're working with low to medium soils. But if you're working on something that's polyester or really rat nasty carpets, you're gonna go ahead and use the higher end of it. Very rarely, even though it's got the directions on there, if you wanna substitute a scoop of Grout Master or a scoop of Pure O2, remember it's already built in, you really don't need it, but if it's just a super rat nasty, nothing's cutting it, you can always add just a little bit of extra power to it. Uh, when it comes to mixing up the product, remember you can use a mixing ball like this push it down inside of there, that's a good little tip. Add your water to the halfway point first, hot water. Then go ahead and put your cleaning product in there, shake it up real good. Go ahead and fill it up the rest of the way and shake it up again. That gets it completely diluted, that way you get nice good even dispersion and it, you don't have to worry about clogging your sprayers up, nothing like that. You really wanna mix it up nice and well, even though these products, all of our products, mix up very quick and easy. And lastly, if you can pre-vacuum, it really does help a lot. Why do I say that? Think about this. I use this illustration and this prop right here inside of my cleaning class. And basically, think about this. If you take this cap off, consider this your insoluble soils. About 70% of your soils in the carpet are already insoluble soils. So if you pull this out of the way and you get right down to the oily carpet, your, your cleaning agents can get right on there and it's not used up for something like this. However, that is the advantage to this product right here. It has that nuclear capability that really cut right through everything, including this right here, so you can go ahead and maximize your time and your efficiency. Okay, so when you really need that extra strength product, remember, Pro 10K. Hey, I wanna take a quick second and thank everyone for their support of Truck Mount Forums. Don't forget, if you could go to our YouTube channel and subscribe, we'd really appreciate it. We're a father and son team that started Truck Mount Forums many years ago, so at truckmountforums.com, 
It's a huge resource where you can take in all types of information, research just about any subject, and take your business to the next level. Also, we have tmfacademy.com, which is an online resource and training school where you can learn all different types of diverse services to make your business more profitable. And if you need any products or any type of equipment and stuff like that, and the products that we've shown in the videos, just go to tmfshop.net. Lastly, if you need some information and you need it really fast, go to our Facebook group, Truck Mount Forums Professionals, and we'll help you there. Well, I'm Rob Allen. Have yourself a great day.